Yo, what is going on, my husbandos and waifus? My name is Hermazar, and welcome to another live reaction review of Sword Art Online. This is going to be episode number 15. Ya boy is a day late. With reason! So, you guys know, uh, yesterday, um, I'm recording this, well, technically it's still yesterday because now it's midnight, but, uh, yesterday I was at Anime Impulse, and I'm still going to be there, um, I just had to be there a little bit early, but, uh, this time, you know, I was like, you know what, I'm still gonna do it, I'm gonna be, like, a day late, but I, I'll still provide it, because usually Sunday, I don't have an upload for you guys, so this is going to be that upload for Sunday, and, um, I'm, I, I'm sorry that I'm late, so I'm gonna really haul in, because I heard this is a really good episode, so... Let's hop into it, my boys. Drop a like and subscribe. Also, um, we got a lot of new f uh, followers and subscribers again because I was part of the Heavenly Controller podcast. Uh, if you guys have, if you guys haven't seen that, that one's a piece of gold. So definitely go check that out. So let's hop into it. Oh yeah, we see the lollies. I forgot it, we, we saw two lollies. <laughs> you know it's hilarious. I'm good with kids, but I fucking hate dealing with them. Kirito's such a bitch, dude. Kirito just left it to him. I I sent some trickery with these kids. Dude, I don't know why. I don't trust these children. I don't trust them. There has to be something wrong with them. They're they're evil. I don't trust lollies here, guys. I'm sorry. Hello? I knew it! I fucking knew it! I knew it. And I should close my door because everyone's gonna wake up because it's super late. I knew it. I knew it. I fucking knew it. This, see, my boys, listen to me. Listen to me. This, listen to me. Listen, listen. This is why we don't trust them lollies. Send this is 28? Hello? Okay, actually, now I get to have a full on listen to the opening because when we we're at the hotel, I couldn't get a full listen. So I'm gonna get a full listen now. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not as, like, dire to get this on Spotify like I was with the Lisa opening. Adamas was fucking heat balls. But this song is good, too. I like the song. Holy shit, that fight looks goddamn fucking epic. Kirito's all fucked up and shit, so... That makes me wonder how fucking wild this part's going to be. We see those lollies. I don't we, I don't want nothing to do with those lollies. Kirito, just kill those lollies. Fuck them. That's cheap shot. Okay, I wouldn't even consider this being them being defeated. They got snuck up on. A true defeat is if they head them face on like a true knight. These aren't fucking integrity knights. They're more like bitch knights. They are not integrity knights. They're bitch knights for that sneak attack. Wait, hey Siri, define integrity. The quality of being honest and having strong moral principles. Moral uprightness. See, that ain't being an integrity knight. That's being a bitch knight. Dude, they're raised to be fucking crazy. That's wild. This this ain't no church, man. The Axiom Church is fucking demonic as fuck. Holy shit. And they seem unfazed by it. I wonder if those two are gonna be the ones to kill each other. Like, at the end, only one can stand. But they're, they're both integrity- Or, oh, bitch knights. They're fucking crazy-ass children. We're good at killing. It won't hurt. Fuck that shit. They're already at the 50th floor. Okay, so this is like one of like the my main complaints with like even SAO, the first one, is that it went by so quick. They could have made like like a whole series of each floor because there's like 100 floors right before they actually, well, they didn't even reach the 100 floor. They ended up fighting the final boss at like one of the earlier floors. So, God, they're already at the 50th floor. That's so fast. Fanatio is like fellatio. God, they're so hungry for, like, they're so hungry for, like, that motherfucking, what do you call it? Respect. Wait, what happened? Wait, how did Kirito be able to get out of that? Oh, shit. Fucking fight? We're gonna get a fight? There's no way you would have something like that if your sister's in training. Okay, so they're not actual integrity knights. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Is Kirito going to fucking take these guys on by himself? I really like that scene, though. He was like, let me fucking educate you. He literally just fucking, fucking, what's the, what's the word that I, that, he schooled them, yes, but he, um, sunned them. <laughs> Is that the word? Yo, these, these guys are about to get fucked, honestly. Let's go, Kirito. Slice and dice these motherfuckers. Dude, animation's top notch. Let's go. 
Oh, he's he's found that Kirito is worthy of this match. Oh, <laughs> this is gonna be so sick, yo. Kirito, fuck this shit up, man. Wooly, wow, wow. Yo, this looks nasty, bro. That man straight up shot a laser. What the fuck? It's like Cloud and Smash. Holy shit, that is scary. That's like a straight bullet. Oh, shit. Ow. Ow. The foot. Holy shit, dude. Oh, shit. Well, I want to see what this is. And created a single sword, which I'm assuming is the sword that he's using right now. Yo, to be honest, like when like it just kind of jitters like that, I feel like we're dropping frames, boys. <laughs> Interesting. He was able to reflect it. Long hair. Why is she? Oh, so what? what? No, yo. Damn, so angry. Damn, Kirito is like, listen, you're the one that's acting that way. Oh, damn, Kirito, angry! Oh my god, let's go, dude! <laughs> He's like, yo, my woman, my woman is like the best swords lady ever. He's like, this is nothing compared to my woman. Dude, Kirito fucking chilling, though. This is a really good match, holy shit. What happened to Kirito's foot, though? She is snacked away. How, what happened to Kirito's foot? <laughs> Yo, girls with the blue hair, oh, I always got a soft spot for. Oh, she got, she could shoot fucking lasers. It looks like her dropping frames. Holy shit. Dude, yeah, cause. Oh, I want to see what this is. Oh, shit. Woo! Oh, whoa, whoa, that looks fucking sick, bro. Dude, Kirito got fucked up. Oh, is this it? Oh, god damn. Oh, here, here's Kirito with the wisdom. Damn, straight to the to the love right there. Oh, we're gonna see Kirito's art! Oh, that's fucking trash! They leave us like that? Oh my god. That is, oh, that is fucked up, dude. This ending song, though. Holy shit. What an exceptional episode, my boys. So this episode, there's a lot of, like, suspense, the action, the fight scene, the animation, the music, the emotion. It was all there a perfect episode of sao and of course a perfect way to leave us in a cliffhanger where we're going to see kirito's art we got to see yujio's enhanced armor and armament or whatever they call it that shit was cool the blue rose so now that we see how yujio does it it seems like his is more on the defensive uh distance attack i'm assuming kirito's is more like physical enhancement that's i'm just assuming but this episode was fucking heat i like that <laughs> i was gonna say fellatio or lady fuck what's her name god damn it i forgot her name already i i, I like how how this integrity night pretty much is this integrity night has been dealing with how people always look at her look down on her because she is a woman no one has tried to fight her seriously because of that kirito is one of the very few people no the only person to actually take her on seriously and kirito admits there are a bunch of swords women that have beaten me and yes even his woman like the fast stabbing style kind of reminded me of asuna so i was like you know what kirito can handle it. he trained with asuna his woman is one of the top skills of swords women this episode done phenomenally the fight scene was fucking sick seeing even yujio's uh, perfect weapon skill or whatever it's called that shit looked fucking nice the animation was on point this episode fucking great also since i had the chance to actually listen fully to the opening i like the opening the ending song is really really dope as well I I actually like the ending song more than the opening my personal opinion i still like adamas more than any of the songs in sao right now wow th this episode is just a wow even like the supposed synthesis 27 29 or whatever they're called the the girl in training integrity nights i didn't even think that was an integrity portion that was like definitely a bitch moment integrity nights fight with honor like that they they fight with reason but they just did a sly move and just stabbed them i and i like that kirito of course kirito and this is what people don't like about him is that he knew what was going to happen he was able to break through it he's the smart one he's overpowered and we saw it right here but we see kirito actually getting himself bodied by 
the integrity night that he was fighting head on. I like that Kirito and Yujiro are legit struggling to fight and that they have to fight together in order to defeat one. This one measly integrity night. They had to fight together to defeat the guy with the arrows. They had to fight together to defeat that guy when they only had chains and such. So there is a lot to take in. Though Kirito, yes, he's overpowered. Yes, it's kind of annoying. Yes, he's he's broken in, in terms of he has the main character kind of gets away with everything. At the same time, I don't know, man. I kind of predicted him to do it. That was like the only disappointing thing, but I understand it. I That's just how SAO is. You know, if you take it as it is and you, and you see what's going to happen, like this was very predictable that Kirito was going to be the one to break it, then by all means, I understand. But anyways, guys, that is my live reaction review. It's a short review, but uh, this episode was phenomenal, done really well, and I like it. So don't forget to drop a like, guys, subscribe, and shout out to everyone that has followed me from Heavenly Controller. I love all of you guys. I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'll be at Anime Impulse, by the way, so if you guys are there today, check me out. Or say hi to me. Check me out. Don't check me out. Ugh.